In this video, we're going to look at um, you know doing similar operations, but uh, maybe getting a different answer uh, when you follow the order of operations, PEMDAS. So we'll do these four examples, and um, let's start with this one. Write this down: twelve divided by six over seven. Write it down and then get the answer. 12 divided by 6 over 7. So please write it down and get the answer. I'll, I'll do it now. So you might remember that you need to multiply by the reciprocal of the fraction on the right. So that means multiply by 7 over 6. Do you remember that? And 12 can be written as a fraction. How would you write 12 as a fraction? It would be 12 over 1, right? And can we cross cancel? We could multiply 12 times 7 to get um, uh, 84 over and then divide by 6, or we could do this 6 into 6 goes once, 6 into 12 goes twice. And now we have 2 times 7 over 1 times 1. So 2 times 7, 14. 1 times 1 is 1. 14 over 1. So your answer should be just 14, right? So now write this one down. 12 divided by 6 sevenths minus 2. Think about the order of operations PEMDAS and calculate what that one should be. 12 divided by 6 over 7 and then subtract 2. Okay, so I hope you've written it down. So according to PEMDAS, should we subtract or divide first? Which one should we do first? So we should divide, right? Should divide, so because because of PEMDAS, we start with parentheses, then we do exponents, then we multiply or divide, then we add or subtract, okay? So multiply or divide, and then add or subtract, right? Okay, so if we divide first it's 12 over 1 times flip it 7 over 6 minus 2 so what's 12 divided by 12 times this of course same thing again 6, 6, 1, 6 and 12 goes twice 2 times 7 over 1 uh, is 14 so we have 14 minus 2 right so that becomes 14 again of course and 14 minus 2 makes right so the first answer was 14 this one is 2 now this one is subtracting 2 but this one has 6 has 6 over 7 times negative 2 do you see that so please write this one down and calculate it now you got to be careful on this one because so 6 so it's 12 divided by 6 over 7 and that uh, times 2 now you got to be careful because pemdas doesn't mean multiply and then divide it doesn't it means multiply or divide from left to right okay so you're going from left to right you do all the parentheses you do all the exponents then you multiply or divide from left to right and then you add or subtract from left to right okay so we just got to watch out for that because we don't do 6 over 7 times negative 2 first no no we need to divide first we need to do this one first okay and then we multiply because PEMDAS says you go from left to right and you multiply or divide whichever comes first because multiplication and division are pretty much the same thing same with addition and subtraction pretty much the same thing you do those from left to right okay okay so when we go from left to right I see the first sign is a division and then I have multiplication so I'll do division first so again 12 over 1 times 7 sixths and we know that that calculates to 14 don't we we did that already so then we got a times by negative 2. So what does that give us? Negative. Negative 28. So a different answer again. 14 this time, 14 or 2 on, was this answer. This one's negative 28. Write this one down and do it. 12 divided by negative 6 sevenths, subtract 2. 12 divided by negative 6 7 subtract 2.
Okay, I hope you've written it down and go ahead and calculate that one and see what you get. Press pause if you need time. Okay, so go ahead and calculate that. So we've got a, a division and a subtraction. Which comes first? Division comes first, right? So again, it's 12 over 1 times the reciprocal of this, which is just flipped upside down, but the same sign, negative 7 sixths. Okay? And then we subtract 2. But we'll leave, forget about the subtract 2 for now, because we're just doing the division right now. And again, obviously, 6 into 6 goes 1, 6 into 12 goes twice. 2 times negative 7 would be negative 14. So we have negative 14 over 1, which is just negative 14, right? And then we subtract 2. So we're subtracting 2 at the end. So negative 14 subtract 2. What does that give you? You're in debt by $14. You spend $2. How, much, what, how far are you in debt now? Or you could change that to plus negative. Now it says 14 negatives plus 2 negatives. 14 negatives plus 2 negatives. More negatives, right? 14 bad guys, 2 bad guys, 16 bad guys. Negative 16. 